Welcome back here in Berlin to the Wanda Nations Cup 2024. Finland against Sweden was the last game and now we will have the game of the men's tournament. So don't get confused here. We have Ukraine against Lithuania. And the Ukrainians will play in black yellow from left to right and the Lithuanians in light green and white and black trousers from right to left. And Anael Eriki is now announcing. So if we just take a look at the starting three. So I see Vasily Olnik, Anton Strelchik and Oleksandr Toparkov for Ukraine. And I see Justas Pazarauskas, Nerius Montvilas and Mantas Pazauskis for the Lithuanian team. Pazauskis on center for Lithuania and Toparkov on center for Ukraine. Now from the right side, Ukraine with the attempt high in the air reflected and they find the ball. The left winger, Pazarauskas, finds it and Pazarauskas now with a high bouncing ball but it's collected by Toparkov. Official timeout clarification, the goal judge was missing on the Lithuanian left post. Now he's there and so Stalechik, the left winger of Ukraine, has the ball in his hands, throws it down the line, but it's deflected by Justas Pazarauskas. No, by Nerius Montevidas. Sorry for that. Montevidas, the right winger for Lithuania from the right side, throws the ball, but it's deflected to the middle line. And this was the center to Parkov. He Brings the ball over the middle line, so ball over and from the left side. Azarauskas with the throw. Toporkov is there again, hands the ball over to Olinik. Olinik goes to the half left, spins around, brings the ball down left side, but it's out. And Montvidas from Lithuania comes from right to half left, spins, throws out. Was going out nearly five meters before the goal of the Ukraine team. And now we see again from the right side, Astrechik down the line, deflected out by Pazarauskas. Justus Pazarauskas with the save, now has the ball in his hands. From the half left, spins, throws, bouncing. Strechik is there. Toporkov brings the ball back to Strechik. Strechik now from the center position, throws it to Montvidas. Montvidas high in the air, but it's going out of bounds. And so next try for Montvidas. He's yes. He spins and then Toporkov has a problem to find the ball. So we have a ball over again. Nil nil the score, 10-29 to go. And besides me, Nadine Merton. So right now the ball is in Montvida's hands and he throws the ball, blocked out. And Olinik, the right winger, moves to the center position, throws the ball, tries to find the gap between Pazowskis and Montvida's. But they saved it and throws the ball really Hard inside the goal, 1-0 for Lithuania, and now Ukraine from the left-hand side, Strelchik, saved by Montvidas, from the center position, blocked as well by the center of the Ukraine team. Pokov and blocked out by the Lithuanian team. Official timeout equipment check. Montvidas. Don't feel 
safe with the eye shades and they checked it. And now the Lithuanian team again from the left side. We see there Pazadauskas spins, throws, and it's saved by Toporkov at the end. Strenik, Strachik was helping him. Strachik get the ball handed over. And he spins, bounce the ball, but into the face of Montvidas. He stands up and from the right post again to Toporkov. Toporkov can save the ball. And now again official timeout because he had the ball in his face and so the eye shades maybe went a little bit to right, to up, to down, to left, whatever, but have to be corrected. And he's not allowed to do it during the game. If he will put his hands on his eye shades without allowance, he would get a penalty against him. So from the right side again. Straight cheek down the line, and the ball is to the middle line. There's Brazauskas, the center. He finds the ball, passes it back to Pazarauskas, Pazarauskas bouncing through the legs of Toporkov, but Strejcik then has the ball, goes to the left post, spins, throws, and the ball by Pazarauskas safe, goes the hands over to Montvidas, Montvidas from the middle, bouncing into the gap, but no, there are Toporkov's left legs, and the ball gets over to the other side, so we have a ball over again, and Montvidas wants to try, bounce high, and the ball is saved by Olinik. Olinik, the right winger, now comes to the middle, spins around, brings it to Montvidas, Montvidas saves the ball to the back of Pazowskis, and then they find the ball now, and Montvidas takes his time, and then starts with the throw down the line, and the ball is out. That was close to the 10 seconds. And Stalecik on the half right spins and throws out. And Gregory Clark, the USA referee, jumps over the ball because it was thrown really hard. If you try to stop that, then you can easily also fall to the ground. So he jumps over this hard thrown ball. And Montvidas for Lithuania gets the ball on the half right, goes to the right post, starts, spins, throws, and the ball, Toporkov, is saved plays to Strelcik. Strelcik from the middle. Spins, throws to Montvidas, saves it. Brazauskas has the ball. Brazauskas hands it over to Pazarauskas. Pazarauskas, large ball into the net. 2 0. And it was. Now we see the slow motion here. You see the bounce and it hits. It hits the long ball line. That was precision at its best. And then no chance for Toporkov to save the ball. 2 nil for Lithuania. First try for Olinik again to Brazauskas. Brazauskas with the counter-attack, but throwing is not his main competence. Now, Strachik again. Brazauskas with a defen the defensive play, finds the ball, goes back, hands it over to Montvidas. Montvidas from the middle, throws down the line. There's Strachik again. Strachik reaches out, has the ball from the middle, spins around from the three meter line, bouncing up in the air, up in the air, and then the ball is in the hands of Pazarauskas. Pazarauskas spins the left, lefty, and then Strachik helps out for Toporkov. The ball is in the hands of Olinik for the, for the half right, spins around down the line, up in the air, up in the air, and the ball is inside. Ball is in, yeah. It's a goal. Gregory Clark and the goal judge decided immediately that the ball was in. So first goal for Ukraine. One to the score. Lithuania started with a loss today. Ten to six against. And now we have a long ball. Now we have a long ball by Monvidas. He was going to the left side and now he throw a long ball. So possibility for Ukraine to equalize the score. 6-46 for the end. Strelcik takes the ball over, but he can give it also to the others as long as he wants. Now he keeps the ball from the middle. He starts. Montvidas in the middle, also to the right corner. Blocked. Blocked by Montvidas. And so 
It is still 2-1. Lithuania from the left side. Kazalauskas again brings the ball to Vorkov is there for the Ukraine and hands it over to Olinik. Olinik. Now from the half left, Kozalskis is there, blocks it out, and so we have the ball on Lithuanian sides. Yes, and the ball will be handed over to Montevides from the half right position. Hard thrown ball blocked by the center of the Ukraine, Toporko. And the ball to Trelchik. Hard thrown ball blocked out. And hand it over to Pasarauskas to the half left. Really straight thrown ball, but blocked. And now it's Olinik. Blocked out by Montevidas. Time out. Time out, please be quiet is the announcement because here are some other teams entering the hall and they are too loud. So Gregory Cl Clark with the announcement and the match is ongoing. The left hand side trial shake and Montevidas tries to keep the ball in front of the goal line and he did it. So it's 2 1 and time out, team time out for Lithuania. And especially if you retake a look at the Ukrainian bench, the substitutes, they're really yeah, preparing themselves with fast movements. And as well on the Lithuanian bench, um, they doing some dips and jumping jacks. So. They want to be prepared for the game, for their sub maybe for their substitutions. And right now, there will be no substitution. We start with. We restart the game after the timeout. And Pasarowska throws the ball, tries to reach the gap between Trashik and Toborkov, but they saved and Olinik with a cross thrown ball blocked by Montevidas. His thrown, he throws the ball out, so the ball will be collected by the goal judge and be replaced on the field, handed over to Trelcik on the left hand side. He moves a little bit to the center, three steps maybe, and then throws the ball, but blocked out by Montevidas. After the Latunian coach, there's the player with n the number two, Arturas Ionikaitis. Um, it seems like he will replace Montevidas, but we will see that maybe later. First, the Trinian throws the ball, blocked out, and will be replaced at the field, and Olinik walks down the crossbar and throws the ball from the right winger position, and blocked by Pasarauskas' hips, and the ball crosses the crossbar, so right now, the team coach, Gleidas Janaika, substitutes like I described before. So Montevidas will be replaced by number two, Arturas Ionikaitis. Yeah, now there's the equipment shake taking place. Anael Rique, the French referee, is happy, so we can restart. And we see Yonikite is going to the left side. Now we have uh, the leg throw from the right side by Pazalauskas. The ball is collected by Toporkov. Toporkov to 
Strelchik, Strelchik with the throw, Brodozowskis with the legs, finds the ball, passes back to the left post to Yonikaitis from the left post. He starts, spins, throws, Tokolkov is there, no problem for him, hands over to Olinik. Vasil Olinik from the half right, spins, throws, down to Yonikaitis, blocked, and Brozowskis finds the ball, hands it over to Pazarauskas, Justus Pazarauskas from the half right, Toporkov at the center takes the ball away, and from the half right, the Ukraine with Olinik again, spins, throws the ball, high bouncing out. Under the body of Yonikaitis, is, it slips through, but it is out of bounds, so still 2-1 for Lithuania. And Yonikaitis, the new left winger, brings the ball. And that was quite close by Wazowskis, I'll tell you later, but there was a throw by the Ukraine. And hands the ball over to Pazarauskas from the right post. He spins, he throws, it's saved. Toborkov searches for the ball, finds it now, passes it back to Strelchik. Strelchik from the left post again, throws down the line, out. Was quite close because you are allowed to talk as long as you have not started the throwing attempt. And Brazowskis is always talking to the last second and now he was talking closely into the throwing attempt with him. So, has to be more careful there at this point. Brazalauskas uh, with the ball to the right post, but no problem at all for Strelchik, the left winger. The ball is out of bounds. And next try for Olinik. He's Came off on the left side, goes now back to the half right. And he spins, he throws, and the ball bounces into the chest of Brazowskis. It's deflected out. And so Pazarauskas hands over to Yonikaitis. Yonikaitis from the middle, goes to the half left, spins, throws hard down the line. Olinik's there. Olinik and his hips block the ball out. And so. 3.13 to go in the first half. Strelchik from the half right. Throws the ball down the line. Out. Throws it out. And so next try for Lithuania. Maybe to widen the gap. From the right side. Pazaraska spins. Throws. The ball is deflected. No, it's uh, blocked outside. And so the ball must be brought back by the goal judge to the 1 meter 50 line, taken over by Strelchik, Strelchik, left post, spins, throws, and the ball is not in, Pazarauskas can save it, and the ball runs over to the other side, so we have a ball over here, and next try for Ukraine, they're getting better into this game after the first two minutes dominated by the Lithuanians. Now, the next throw up in the air, and it goes over the crossbar from the legs of Mantas Blazowskis. It goes up in the air, and then maybe half a meter over the crossbar. 2.42 to go, 2-1 two, still the score. Yonikaitis from the left post. And now, he brings the ball, high ball. Was a high ball by Justus Levaturas Yonikaitis. And so we have a penalty for Team Ukraine. Ionikite is standing at the three meter, four meter line. And from the right side, Olinik, he starts, he turns, he brings the ball. It's in, it's in, it's in. Over the knees, over the knees of Ionikite. It slips through. 2 2, the score. 2 37, a two goal. And. Again, we see Justus Pazarauskas from the right side, down the line. It's safe. Toporkov finds the ball, brings it back to Strelchik. Anton Strelchik from the middle brings the ball to the left side, but it's out. No problem for the Lithuanian defense. 2-2, two, two, the score 2-18 to go. And the ball 
will be replaced. And Kazarauskas hands the ball over to Ionikaitis, the left winger. He wa walks straight above the line and his small ball blocked by Vasil Olinik. He throws the ball as, ball as well, blocked by the center Mantas Kazarauskas. Thrown by Kazarauskas, blocked out Vasil Olinik. And Anton Stalczyk is carrying the ball to the left hand side, throws the ball trying to reach the gap between the center and the right winger, but Pazarowskas is already walking down the crossbar to throw the ball, but it was too fast, high ball, long ball, personal penalty, and time out, and the Ukrainian coach shows that there's the floor seems to be slippery, so there's some sweat on the floor, and he wants that they check it, but there's nobody around right now, and the referees are saving the situation so the sweat will be taken off the floor and we will be back on the pitch. So personal penalty and it's Justas Pazerauskas. He's really straight to the six meter line and the Ukrainian team stood together and the game isn't restarted right now because of the floor situation. So the goal judge is doing it on his own, preparing the floor and the Ukrainian team is really close to each other the three players and Vasil Olenik will throw the ball, drop the ball. This is the announcement, drop the ball that everybody knows where the ball is. Olenik throws and he scored. The ball passes, passes gas on the right post position and the Ukraine scored, so it's their third goal, 3-2 for Ukraine. And uh, Toporkov gets the ball in his hands, hands it over to Strenchik from the left post. He starts, 120 to go Strenchik, saved by Rozowski's hands over to Rozanowskas, the right winger. Spins to the center position, to the gap now, it's taken away. Olenik, Olenik from the middle, spins again, and to Bazarowskas out. Outside left of the field, the ball. And so Lithuania, and the Lithuanian coach Kleiners Janaika didn't seem so happy about the last uh, call about the long ball. Says, okay, this is a long ball, but they had the same, why, why are you just judging it on our side? So he's a little bit, he's not amused. Next try from Lithuania, Toporkov takes it away. And Strelchik from the middle goes to Pazowski. Yes, Pazarowskas likes are there. And he can keep the ball. Pazarowskas from half left, bouncing ball high in the air, deflected, and goes over to the Lithuanian side. Ball over. And uh, so after this high deflection back into the half, of Lithuania. Next try for Arturas Ionikaitis. And now Ionikaitis to Toporkov. High in the air again. The ball is collected by Strelcik. Strelcik on the left post. Swings down the line. Up in the air. Ball is in the hands of Pazarauskas. 
as Alaskas comes from the half left. And now left throw, but Topolkov's chest is there in his way again. Olenek from the right side, eight seconds to go. Next try to Pazaraskas, five seconds. Fast attack, out. With 3.0 seconds on the clock. It is two to three for Ukraine, or three to two for Ukraine. And now we have maybe one final throw by the Ukraine, or maybe they keep the ball as well. We'll see. The ball is now thrown by Strelchik, throws it down the line, and it's saved by Pazarauskas. This was close. Under the arms of Mantas Brozowski, it slipped through, and uh, Pazarauskas helped him out. So, first half is over. They change now sides, and uh, Montvidas now is running into the Ukraine team. Coach Fedia Dubrovin from the Ukraine helps out, and... Now we'll have the next Lithuanian uh, player running anywhere <laughs> in the gym. It's now <laughs> fetched up by Kleidas Janaika. He's smiling. The first time I see him smiling, the coach, and says, no, 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 not this direction. Totally wrong. Follow me, follow me. And now they are back on the crossbar, waiting there for the equipment check for the second half. We just take a look. Uh, Montvidas seems to come back in again, and uh, number three, Justus Pazarauskas, is out for the Lithuanian team. And on the Ukraine side, I would admit that uh, we see the same starting three in the second half. Then in the first, left winger is Strecik, right winger Alinek, and center player is Toporkov. And so we'll have them uh, in nearly 90 seconds it will go on with this game here and maybe I'll just try to take a look to Jim B in this moment what's happening there because Germany is playing there Germany 3 Brazil 10 so Brazil is really leading in the other gym if you want to hear commentation in German, just switch over to Jim B, because all the German games are broadcasted in German. All the other games we'll do in English. So now, Anael Enrique, the French referee, is on the Ukraine side with the equipment check. And Gregory Clark, the US-American referee, is on the Lithuanian side doing the equipment check. On the left winger position, they'll start with Joni Kaitis, right winger Montvidas, and the center is Brazauskis. And the Ukraine, I already told you, 12 minutes uh, to go, and we'll just take a look. We'll have a short lunch break after this game at uh, 2 30. We'll start again here with a men's game between uh, Group B, Pool B, Egypt against Finland. And uh, We'll also will have uh, on the other gym Montenegro with their first uh, appearance in this tournament after staying in Belgium unwillingly the last night against Poland. And so now the game can continue. And now the substitutions are announced by Anna Enrique. And now Ukraine with the next try. They start the second half from the half right. There is Alinek. Vasil Alinek. Make myself stretch it, but now problem for Brazowskis. Brazowskis to Montvidas. Montvidas from the right side, bouncing down the line. Stretch is there, but the ball is going to the neutral zone. It's out. It's out. So it's in ball over. Gregory Clark immediately with the call. Ball over. And so Lithuania with Montvidas having the ball in his hands from the right post at the crossbar to the half right. 
starts, spins, throws, but there is a top ball call. Seem really calm in the defense, top ball call. Straight shake with the next try, it's left outside the throw by Strelchik. And next try now for Yurika. It is from the left side. And the ball is brought back by Topolkov. So we have a ball over again. Ball over again. Official timeout, equipment check by the Lithuanian team. And now we need some tape because some of the they have to be retaped the court. There is uh, something ripped off, and so Gregory Clark is a handyman himself. Before I tell the people what I want from them, I'll do it myself. And mostly, this is also the fastest way to do. And now, from the left side, Arturas Ionikaitis bounces the ball once, bounces the ball twice. Now that goal judge takes the ball, Gregory Clark goes back on his side. He's the far side referee. And now Ionikaitis waits and now spins, throws. The ball is saved by Strachik. Strachik from the middle. Chu Unikaitis has some problems. Brasalskis finds the ball, brings it back. And Montvidas from the middle to the gap into the net. 3-3, three, three. Montvidas finds the gap between Toporkov and Strachik. The left wing and the center of Ukraine. And so, 3-3. Three, three. And Olinik, has he a response? From the half right, spins, throws, and the ball is saved. Brazauskas secures it, gives it back to Unikaitis. The left winger down the line, it's saved by Topolkov after being blocked by Olinik. Now stretching from the half right, down the line, and again, complaints. But there's a goal for, you, for Lithuania, goal for Lithuania. The coach was complaining about a long ball, but Yoni Kaitis doesn't care about it, takes the ball, makes the counter attack, and oh. finds the gap again between Stoporkov and Strelchik. The left winger in the center. So 4 to 3 for Ukraine. Next try from Olinik. It's blocked, and Brazowskis hands the ball over to Montvidas. Again from the middle, tries to get Toporkov again. Toporkov. Blocks the ball over to the other side, so Lithuania has the ball. And the ball will be handed over to Montevidas. He's walking down the crossbar and throws the ball really straight, but Tupokov saves the ball like that, and then it's Anton Strelch. Also saved by the Lithuanian team. The counterattack Montevidas also blocked by Topokov. Next try, Olinik with a cross ball and the ball is above the crossbar, deflected by the hips of Montevidas. Montevideo from the half right, thrown across the field, but blocked out by Olinik. Olinik, the right winger, starting from the right post, with a spin thrown ball blocked by the chest. Montevideo with his chest and his center, Prasowskis hands the ball over to him and he throws the ball blocked. Next try, Strelchik, Anton Strelchik, the left winger, blocked by Montevidas. And now they have some seconds to take a breath because it was really fast the last 
two minutes and the ball is replaced and Olnik had the ball in his hands, throws the ball blocked by Brazowski. Monikaitis throws the ball but saved by the Ukrainian team against Trezik, the left winger blocked out and the ball will be back on the right hand side of the Lithuanian team and Montevidas hands the ball over to Ionikaitis. The left winger starts with a throw, uh, with a spin, throws the ball and blocked by Olinik. Taking the ball, moving to the half left, spins around and throws, but really straight to the body to Pazowski's in the center of the Lithuanian team. Montevidas blocked out by Olinik. Eight minutes still to go, four, two, three, and we have some equipment check. Anel Rick, the French referee, checking the eye shades of Vasil Olinik. And he himself has the ball in his hand, spins around, throws, and blocked by the chest by Johnny Kaitis. And now, Yonikait is from the left side. Olinik is there, Strachik is there. And now Topakov finds the ball, plays it back to Strachik. Now 10 seconds, getting close, and he brings it out. He brings it out just in time. And now Strachik is looking, where is the field? Where is the field? The goal judge should help him, maybe. And the goal judge should help him, maybe. And now... The guy is missing, and now the ball is high in the air. Good. It's not in. It's not in. <coughs> that was Strelchik searching for the field and was wandering around. And then in the right situation, he comes back. So next try for Olinik from the half right. He spins, he throws, and the ball is blocked. Next try for Brazowski. Yeah, he gets the ball, brings it to Montevideo's. 7.30 on the clock. Montevideo's large bounce, nearly a long ball. And Strelchik with the save. Strelchik on the left side, on the half left. Goes, throws, Brazowski is there, and hands it over to Joni Kaitis. Doras Yonikaitis from the half line spins, throws, and the ball is in the arms of Toprakov. Toprakov brings it to Olinik to the right winger. And Toprakov from the right side spins, throws down the line, and the ball is at the back of Brazowski's. Montvidas has it. Montvidas grabs it with his, with his hands. And then Montvidas, the next try on the hat of Toprakov. And he brings the ball to Olinik from the middle. He starts now. Brings the ball to Brazowski's. Brazowski's catches the ball now, or finds it, brings it back to Montvidas. Montvidas high bouncing ball, oh, but Toprakov is there again. And the wingers were coming into the center behind him to help him out. Next try now down the line, but Strelchik is stopped by Brazowski's. Brazowski's passes back to Unikaitis from the half left. Now he has a little bit hurrying up and then the throw nearly a high ball but now we have a substitution on the Ukraine side number one is going out and it's, uh, this is Vasil Olinik and in comes Rorion Shihalin and we don't see Any Lithuanian getting ready, so after the equipment check, it can go on. And the
player Xi Harlin goes also to the right post, but now goes over to the left. So, so Stracic is on the right winger position and the first goal. First throw, Xi Harlin with the goal. Four, four, five, mi six minutes and seven seconds to go. And from the half left, there is Joni Kaitis. Joni Kaitis brings the ball up in the air, inside the net. Inside the net again. What a response there. This must be the four to five for Lithuania after this throw here. And next try by Shihalin, Rodion Shihalin goes with on the center. Blazowskis collects the ball, brings it back to Montevideo's Montevideo's on the left side into the net. Shihalin with problems. In the offense, he scores one off out of two. But in the defense, he got two in a row. Rodion Shihalin with some problems there by the throw of Montevideo's. And now from the right side, Strelchik again down the line in the back of Brazoskis, but there is Yoni Kaitis. Secures the ball, starts, spins, throws down the line. Strelchik is there, counter-attack by Strelchik. Strelchik, nearly high ball, high ball, yeah. Nearly not, nearly a high ball. It was a high ball, and El Enrique decides. So we have a penalty here, and uh, we'll see Montvidas with the throw. And he's going to the left side. Montvidas spins, throws into the net. Seven to four. Nerius Montvidas from the middle to the left post. And the ball hits in. Strachik without a chance to defend. Seven to four. The gap is widening up for Lithuania. Shihalin from the half left, spins, throws, and the ball is blocked. Brazowskis gets the ball, passes it back to Montvidas. Montvidas from the half right, spins, throws, down the line, out, out. And so, next try. Sorry for the technical problems here. There was a goal for Ukraine over the legs of Brazowskis. It goes into the net. Fifth goal for Ukraine, seven for Lithuania. Four minutes, 46 seconds to go by now. Shihalin with the throw down the line and it's blocked. It's blocked by Montvidas. It's getting closer to the crunch time. And Nerius Montvidas with the throw down the line. Shihalin is there, blocks the ball. Timeout taken by the Ukraine coach Fedir Dubrovin. And so also Victoria Poshivailo comes there, handing over the bottles to the players. Seven five for Lithuania. This really starts turning into a nail biter here at the Vanda Nations Cup 2024 in goalball. And the Ukraines will have the next attack. On the half left, Shialin has the ball. ball is bouncing into the chest and now again on the right side there is Montvidas, Montvidas down the line it's blocked by Strelchik, Strelchik has, gets the ball back by Dobrokov, Dobrokov's ball then to Strelchik, Strelchik's ball across from right to left is saved and now Montvidas with the next try down the line. Shialin is there. Ball is dancing in the field and it's out. It's blocked out by 
Rurian Shialin and uh, the Lithuanian coach Kleidas Janaika is preparing for his next substitution. But now Shialin from the half right starts again. Throws the ball and it's up in the air and the ball goes into the arms of Brazowskis. Hands it over to Nerius Montvides. Montvides half right brings the ball and it's deflected now down the line. There is Brazowskis. Brazowskis is uh, now stopped by the substitution of his coach. Number one is going out. Nerius Montvidas and now back in number three, Justus Pazarauskas. <laughs> Now the ball with Rodion Shialin from the middle to the net. No, there's Pazarauskas. He's on the right winger position. Yoni Kite is on the left winger position. Pazarauskas with the throw. Strauchik is there. And now we have a timeout for Ukraine taken. Two minutes, 59 seconds to go. Fedia Dubrovin, uh, the coach, is talking mainly to Rodion Shihalin and also to Strachik, his main attackers. Toporkov, the defensive center, is sitting there on the floor. And uh, so maybe the next throwing schemes are prepared for Team Ukraine. Two goals down and now stands in the middle and now from the half right stretch spins throws and the ball is in the air now it's in the arms of Brazowskis hands it over to Yonikaitis Yonikaitis to Shialin and Shialin with the block and so next try by the Ukraines half left Spins Shialin to Pazowskis, he's there. Hands it over to Pazarowskis on the right side. Down the line, out on the line, in that side. And we'll have now the ball handed over to Rodion Shialin from the middle. He starts, he spins, he throws and it's blocked. And Yonikaitis from the left side plays the ball can across, but there's Shialin's chest. Two minutes and 15 seconds to go. Seven to five for Team Lithuania. From the half right, Strachik to the middle, up in the air, and it's saved. It's saved from the last second. And we have a result from the other gym. Brazil beats Germany 16 to 6. And now the ball is ball over. Ukraine's with the block, but it's out. It's going out in the neutral zone. So Lithuania with the throw from the left side, bouncing. Toprakov is there, hands it over to Strelchik. Strelchik on the middle position, spins to the right, out, 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 out. At the six meter line on the right, it goes out of bounds, bounce. 145 to go. And there is the goal judge again, hands the ball over to Pazarauskas. Pazarauskas goes to the half right from the left side. And now 
Starts, spins, throws. He's a lefty, so he's throwing with the left, with his left arm, with his left hand. So Ukraine has to take a little bit more risk, maybe, with that throw. Shihali with the throw. Throws it, and the ball bounces up, and it's blocked out of bounds. So both teams try to get very precise, but not taking too much risk. And on the left side, there was a mobile device switched on here in the gym, so we have an official timeout noise. And from the left side, we see Pazaraskas. Now it's Yoni Kaitis from the left side going to the Right side, Shihali, Shihali with the counter attack. There's Brazowskis, Brazowskis keeps the ball, has it in. And there is Pazarowskis, Pazarowskis from the half left spins, bouncing. Strategic is there, Strategic stands up. And now go to the right post, tries to go down the line. The ball is in, the ball is in from the feet of Brazowskis. It's deflected inside. So this is the sixth goal for Ukraine. One minute and two seconds to go seven six for lithuania and i assumed this could be a nail biter now it is a nail biter from the half right Azaraskas with the answer no top rock up but can he find the ball yeah he finds the ball and then hands over to strategic strategic again from the right side down the line but then it's blocked by unikaitis 44 seconds clock is running and now Unikite is again to Shiali, blocked out, blocked out, and we have 35.9 seconds to go. And now the last time I think by taken by the coach of the Ukraine. 35.9 seconds to go. And so maybe two throws. When they get lucky, maybe three throws, they will get to equalize here. So it's nearly the last chance for Team Ukraine. And now it is over. Rodion Shiali takes the responsibility, he takes the ball, starts from the middle, spins around, throws it hard, Brazowskis is there, timeout taken by Lithuania, timeout taken by Lithuania, and so well, the coach Kleidos Janaika tells especially Arturas Yonikaitis, what he now wants to have from him as a throw. And uh, yeah, the next game will be at 2.30 here in Gym A, Egypt against Finland men's tournament, uh, Group uh, Pool B. And in uh, Gym B, we will have a um, Group A game, Montenegro against Poland. And now we'll see. Joni Kaitis from the left post, he starts and he takes time. Brazowskis counts him in and now the throw is taken away by Toparkov. Strelchik, less than 20 seconds from now. Strelchik from the right side throws it down the line and it's in, it's in, it's in, it's in! Goal, 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 goal for Ukraine. Strelchik, we see it now in the slow motion. Over the legs of Brazowskis, then jumps up in the air and then in to the over the hip of Yoni Kaitis 7-7 seven, seven the score 14.5 seconds to go timeout taken by Lithuania so close to win the game so close to get the three points and now maybe one shot left to get this three points back they had 10 seconds to go, holding in their hands. 
And now the table has something to discuss. Official timeout clarification. Timeout that the table will have a problem. Uh, the, the table has uh, so far, sorry for switching into German. Um, and I think they want to see if uh, everybody took their timeouts correctly. Yeah, everything seems to be fine. So 14.5 14, 14 seconds to go. Pasarauskas from the left side this time. He's counted in. And now he starts, spins, throws, ball is saved. Four seconds to go. Shihalin has to hurry up. Substitution, Ukraine, to stop the clock this time. 2.0 seconds to go. There's just a substitution to stop the clock. Strelchik is going out. Yevgeny Sihanenko it's co is coming in. And... So they will have the last throw, the Ukraines. Two seconds to go. The ball has to be over the goal line before the two seconds elapse. And so he has to hurry up. Two seconds to go here. Official timeout. Check. You need to go outside with that phone. Outside. Somebody has a problem with his mobile devices. Still ringing now. Shielding with the throw, the last throw. The, it's over. It's over. It's over. 7-7. Seven, seven. Uh, the final score here. Lithuania against Ukraine. And so we'll have a short break. At, in 20 minutes, we'll be back at 2.30 with the game Egypt against Finland.